Hello YouTube, my name is Caleb Waller, um, known as Sensation Phenomenon on here, and as promised, this is going to be my very short um, collections video of my um, Nintendo Game Boy games. This covers the original Game Boy, the Game Boy Color, and the Game Boy Advance. Um, all of these games um, I consider to be amongst some of the rarest titles out there, and these are, in fact, bootlegs, but the fact that these are bootlegs makes them even more interesting and rarer at the same time. So, um, yeah, um, a very small collection here, but for me it's quality over quantity. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you each one and um, just explain a little bit about each one. So I'm going to start off with um, The Lord of the Rings for the Nintendo Game Boy Color. I uh, recently did a package video of this because I got this as a trade from my friend Joe, um, who lives in Ireland, who's got his own channel. Um, so yeah, this is The Lord of the Rings. It was never released for the Game Boy Color and um, it's a very interesting game um, and uh, it's very rare. I've never seen this on eBay before um, and I'm sure anybody who's a fan of The Lord of the Rings series um, would love to get their hands on this game, especially seeing as um, the whole franchise is being renewed this year with the, uh, the launch of the, uh, the new movie uh, called The Hobbit, which is a prequel to The Lord of the Rings. So that keeps things fresh and interesting for this concept. Next up is something very interesting. This looks like an ordinary copy of Pokemon Blue, but I in fact modded the actual cartridge myself. I basically bought a game called um, Pocket Monster Sapphire, Pokemon Sapphire RPG, um, made by Syntax. Um, it's quite a known game by a lot of people who know about pirates. I basically took the cartridge out, um, the actual PCB board, um, took it out of the cartridge itself because the cartridge was in terrible condition and I actually um, fitted it into this original um, Pokemon Blue uh, cartridge it took me ages to get the fit all neat and perfect so this is not Pokemon Blue this is Pokemon RPG um, Pokemon Sapphire RPG um, all known as Pocket Monster Sapphire RPG made by Syntax and it's a very good game it's um, made completely from scratch not a hack of something else um, and it's a Pokemon game unlike any other so um, these are very hard to find on eBay. I've seen um, about two or three of them on eBay in the past couple of years. Um, so they are, you can buy them and they do seem to go for really cheap. So if you see one, definitely buy it. And the original artwork is nothing more than the, um, the rip-off um, artwork of Pokemon Sapphire for the uh, Game Boy Advance. Next up is something very rare, is um, Pokemon Silver and Gold 2 and 1, but this is not your bog standard English or English hack, this is the original Japanese fake. Um, so anybody who's anybody knows that um, to find fake Pocket Monsters Japanese games is extremely hard, let alone a 2 in 1 multi cart like this. You can see the artwork is Japanese, it says game, interesting logo, and then on the back it says um, made in China. Uh, pattern pending. It actually looks quite authentic um, but it is a fake um, but it's a bootleg of Pocket Monsters Japanese and it's the f proper Japanese releases two, two together on one cartridge fake um, and it's just very hard to find bootleg Japanese um, Pocket Monsters games from the Game Boy series. Um, furthermore is something even more interesting a super color 28 in 1 which contains pocket monsters blue pocket monsters yellow pocket monsters green and pocket monsters red i'm saying pocket monsters because these are bootleg versions of the pocket monsters games for the original game boy these are not english versions these are not english versions these are the original japanese translations um well original versions nothing's translated these are the original pocket monsters japanese releases so to find these individually is hard enough um there's a website that shown one picture of pocket monsters red a fake version so to find all four together on a multi cartridge is even more harder to find this cost me a little bit of money and it's also got other games like bomber man and the uh, the bog standard rubbish that you usually find on there um yeah, it's black and grey for some weird reason. It says made in Japan, but it's definitely bootlegged. So, um, yeah, that's interesting. And also the fact that you can play these games in colour using the um, the old trick with the directional pad to um, flip the colour pan it um, is really good as well. Next up, um, I don't have a cartridge for this. This is um, Pokemon Red and Blue 2 in 1 in Spanish. So this is another bootleg, I believe. Um, I'm not sure if it's original or a bootleg. The actual um, circuit board looks really well made. 
Um, I've got it in a plastic protective case to keep it protected, but it's Pokemon Red and Blue. I've never, ever, ever seen a Red and Blue um, together in a multi cartridge, let alone in Spanish. And this is a proper Spanish version. Um, so I don't know if this is real or fake. I think it is fake, but again, another very hard to find game. I've never seen this on eBay before. Um, the original artwork that the original cut it came in a cartridge, but the artwork was really poorly done. It was just red and blue stretched together to fit the actual um, sticker space for the uh, cartridge. So nothing special. I'm looking to find a replacement just to put it in a mint cartridge um, later down the line. And then last but not least, by no means least, it's a very, very special game. Probably my most um, special of them all. Um, and this was a really expensive purchase. This was about £30 for bootleg. And this is a 64-in-1 for the uh, Game Boy Advance. Now this, believe it or not, actually has an original Pokemon Gold for the Game Boy Color on it, amongst others such as Sonic 5 and um, Super Mario 4 as well. Um, and this is a bootleg. As you can see, it says Game... And if we flip it to the back, it's got one of those horrible stickers and it just says game, um, model number ABU, some rubbish. Um, the actual sticker is nothing special either. But it does have, for a Game Boy Advance cartridge, to actually have Pokemon Gold, the Game Boy Color version, not a stupid NES hack side-scrolling thing. This is the original real deal. So this means I can play Pokemon Gold on the Game Boy Micro and the Nintendo DS and the DS Lite systems without having to emulate anything using stupid flash cartridges and seeing all that horrible text at the bottom or anything. This is extremely hard to find. This is definitely the rarest of them all and probably the most special of them all. And for all of these multi cartridges, for any of them, if anybody wants to see gameplay, except for the Lord of the Rings because Joe Shaw's already done that, if anyone wants to see gameplay of these um, games, please let me know and I will do a video of them in due course. But yeah, this is definitely the most special of them all. Super Mario 4, side-scrolling Game Boy game, Sonic 5, all well-known hacks um, for Game Boy. But Pokemon Gold original Game Boy Color version, so hard to find um, on the Game Boy Advance. Never seen it before, probably never see it again. That's all I have for now, guys. Take care. Thanks for watching and goodbye for now.